Hello students, today we are going to discuss about what is the distance and the displacement and what is the main difference between the distance and displacement, how those values and all will vary and what is the dimensional formula for the distance and displacement, what is the main difference between the distance and displacement we are going to discuss in this video and my name is Venkat Sai and our channel is Master Tuition Point and today we will we supposed to start the content. Now let us take, there are two points, A and B, okay. To reach from A to B, let us think uh, this is a, your house and you want to go to your school. You are supposed to go to the school or college, means there are n number of ways. There is no only particular one way, no, means you are, there is no only one way. There are n number of paths to reach from, uh, from your home to the school, yes or no, but at a time you can able to choose only one path. Okay, na? either it is a some other uh, street through the some other street or some other street, but you can able to choose only one path like that only whichever the path you are supposed to choose that actual path right now we are supposed to take this one. This path is called the distance. I am supposed to choose this path. I am choosing this path. This is the distance. If you are supposed to choose this path means this is the distance. Okay, na? whoever based upon your uh, path, you can you can able to choose whatever the path, the actual path traveled by a body is called a distance. Actual path means what is the original, original path you are supposed to move from the one point to the another point is called the distance. And here distance means, uh, for suppose I can able to tell from uh, our distance, uh, distance uh, between Nello to Buchi is uh, 15 kilometers. Uh, we can able to see the road. Now, is there any only particular way we are going to in a straight line or I am going to be in a left turn itself? No, no. There are n number of curves and all everything. Means there is no particular direction on all for the distances. But the magnitude will be there. That's why the distance will become the scalar quantity. Okay, na? and what is displacement? The shortest distance among these n number of paths, there will be one shortest one, no? that shortest distance between initial and final point is called the displacement. The shortest distance between initial point and final point is called the displacement. Okay, hope you understand the content, what is distance and the what is displacement. Distance means uh, the actual path traveled by a body is called the distance. Displacement means uh, the shortest distance. Shortest distance means there will be a particular direction. Okay, now particular direction will be there for the shortest distance. That's why we are supposed to call it as a displacement because it is having the magnitude as well as the direction. That's why it will become the vector quantity. And distance is always the positive only. Okay, now for suppose I am going to like this. Again, I am coming. Again, coming like this. Means uh, whatever the round it is uh, supposed to take uh, like a straight line or whatever it is. Uh, the distance will be always positive. Always you need to place, place the values and all. But displacement is not like that. I went to here. Again, I came back. Means uh, my displacement is zero here. My displacement is zero because wherever I reached, started, again I came back to the initial position. That's why my displacement may be zero, positive, negative or it will become the zero also displacement. And similarly, what's the SI unit of uh, distance is meter and same units for the displacement and CJS unit is centimeter and CJS unit is just centimeter. And the dimensional formula will be same for both things. Uh, what is the dimensional formula? How we are right? We are supposed to take the three fundamental physical quantities mainly M, L, T. M means mass, L means length, T means time. In the unit, is there any mass? Means any kg or anything? No, no. That's why it will become zero. And is there any length? Length means unit is meter only, no? Length is there. What is the power of this meter? One. L power, one. Is there any time here in the unit? No. That is, it will become zero. You can write this one or you can directly write L. L is the dimensional formula. And what's the most and very, very important, what's the main difference between the distance and displacement means uh, distance is a scalar because there is no particular direction. Displacement is a vector quantity. 
okay hope you like the content and in next video we are supposed to see what is uh, distance and displacement in a circular path how we are supposed to use the pythagoras theorem for the displacement to find the displacement and all hope you like the video please like the video it will motivate me to do the more videos and all uh, related to the class level motion in a straight line topic thank you please subscribe